Glad to have you join us again. It's Business Breakfast. If you just joined us, this is iBrand Television flagship business program. We're talking business here, and it's now time for us to get into the segment where we talk about issues that has to do with the capital market. Bring out the figures, analyze them, and give you insights on how you can invest at the capital market. But before we dive into the conversation, let me read this out to you. In the trendy week ended Friday, February the 9th, the Nigerian Exchange Limited All Shell Index and Market Capitalization depreciated by 2.45% and 2.49% to close at 101,858.37 basis points and 55.7 trillion naira, respectively. The market recorded total turnover of 2.47 billion shares worth for 7.85 billion naira in 54,982 deals, in contrast to a total of 3.89 billion shares valued at 95.14 billion naira. The financial services industry measured by volume led the activity chart with 1.68 billion shares valued at 28.51 billion billion naira traded in 25,751 deals, thus contributing 68.1% and 59.58% to the total equity turnover volume and value respectively. As always, I have joining me now live in our Lagos studio, Ambrose Omodion, Chief Research Officer, Invest Data Consulting Limited. Ambrose, good morning. It's a pleasure, as always, having you join me on the program today. Thanks for having me, blessed. Ambro, before we dive into the conversation today, a, a sad incident happened over the weekend that led to the demise of um, the group executive officer of uh, Access Holdings Limited in person of um, Abbott Wigwe and the former group and um, the former chairman of the NGS, uh, Mr. Um, Ogumbajo. What do you have to say concerning this, this uh, sad incident? You don't say that for me, I will say maybe I saw it as a piece of this part of life, but uh, I think for me, the market. Uh, Feel their, you know, their impact, but I believe that you know access to have uh, all cost social plan before now, and I, and I trust Wigley because it's a guy that plans for the future. Mm. I know that they will have their own plan. That's why when people are calling me, we just bring the price of access bank to a thing mm. that it's not possible mm. because they have a, you know a timetable, a strategy they are following, mm. which I know that it's not only Wigley, it's no, it's driving that. Mm. Others are in that. I believe that uh, they will continue, but for me. Nigeria have lost really a resource, a chain, a, a, yes. a very resource it, person. I know the guy that can think outside the boss. That, that you, is what I love him for. I'm no, telling you that. Me, it, exactly. It brought a lot of innovation into the, the Nigerian banking, financial yeah, sector yeah. and it caused a lot of reforms, a, a lot of disruptions, so, so to say. We see a lot of mergers and acquisitions, no. a lot of. The a lot guy is busy acquiring, acquiring. Even across, across the country. Yes. No, continent. Beyond the continent, yes. No, the guy was Within the continent and outside. The guy was trying to build assets to become the next first leading bank in nigeria and africa and the guy is always there already there as we speak now the the gross end of access bank you swallow all the banks in nigeria mm -hmm. even all the old banks and the new ones disney bank GC, in terms of their gross earnings it's only on the, on the on the bottom line because when you are acquiring you are spending more of your money mm -hmm. that's why it's not reflecting on their bottom line but for me let's believe that yes others will continue that journey but i know that access bank has a team and also this is an opportunity also for the former uh, md before him uh, we, um, Model, okay, model, I, 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 more model, you know, for me, you know, because two of them had this vision when they yes, yes. that God have kept him. But he was, he was, he was the start, um, um, the, the, the leading uh, empty when they started off. What I mean, that, but he stepped down. Yeah, but what are I you mean saying that, he should come no, back on board? At this time, he can be in, in the in the board. The that, board. Either a manager, uh, the, the chairman of the of the group that will give him more you know, inside to look at. Because as a chairman, you oversee both the management and also the board. Yes, yeah. yes. For me, it's a good time for me to come because I know that. Those guys you know what they are doing. You can see how they started from one corner in, in Lekki. They came out, they started all over the world. They moved to Africa now. They are launching out for me. Yeah, <laughs> they, 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 I think they, they, as at last year, there was um, the launch of um, Access Bank in France. Yes, yes. Also, also they now have their, they also have their own payment platform already. Who yes. I know that, that one will pull the bank. For me, I think at this time, you know, if, I, if I'm not on the board, but I, if they're hearing me, I think they said, they said, come and join us, be the chairman, and also let's continue. Let's talk about this now <laughs> as, as to how it relates to us now. This is the capital market segment of the program here. Yeah. So, but. In what way do you think that this uh, this sad um, situation has affected um, assets bank shares at the capital market? No, no. One thing is that uh, you know, like I said earlier, no organization is tied to an individual. Mm, very true. Because they have a board, they have management team. Oh, that means fine. Like I said, don't forget that the time uh, GTV lost their own uh, former MD. Yes. No, I'll tell you. Since then, 
the confidence investor has in GTB has improved. Mm. Because they've seen successor not coming easily, and that has boosted government. I know that, yes, Modoke is, 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 is around, and yes, you know, very unfortunately that we lost the man that we know that his world, that you know, the visionary, that you know everything, but I know that others will follow. But also, they will boost the confidence we have in, in the assets. If we are seeing the same move, the same speed, we are seeing people now, say yes. That means even the next generation to go happen, they have seen the value more. For example, now, in Zinet Bank, Zinet Bank don't go outside Zinet to take any MD. It's within the people that have grown around it that understand. Yes, you know, and I know that assets will not be without a separate. That's why I'm not you know, top board, but I know that, yes, the guy will lose fine, but I know that things will come. Let's go. talk about succession planning a little bit. I've seen that happen within some tier one banks i've seen that happen in uba uba is very strong at that and like you rightly mentioned i've seen that also happen in um um, um, um zenith bank as well even and, uh, gt gt yes very very true but how do we make other banks to have that strong corporate governance um, um strategy within them to create that succession planning that brings about a continuity within the management team you no know, you can see the life of uh, um what's it called Sterling Bank and all that. Before now, mm. they, they bring people from outside, outside and yeah. the person now bring its own strategy, try to, but now they all know, know that this time, somebody within the, the team that understand where we are going, also have grown with the bank, mm. will know where they are going. It's, better. The, the and it's not only for a banking sector. It is also be repeated in other, all other organizations. Sectors. Yes. Yeah. Why? When you have a successful plan, not that, you know, because you are the owner of the company, let's say something happen, your son, I have no background for many years, come master headed. You see, we drag the company back. But people in that board, in that team management team, they understand. You should be the best to step out. You will feel the, the, the gap, you will feel mm. the board, you mm. understand where they are going. Mm. But the when you, not be felt. When, when you bring somebody outside, when we realize why, you know, in any successful community we have seen that have made and have still, you know, test of time, they have that successful plan. And that is why they are stronger and stronger. Because when you come in, we already see a plan like access bank. They have five years rolling plan. Every five years they come in that, and that's why they are mm. standing. When Kelly was there, and when Mokere was there, every five years they tell you ahead this way we are going. Mm. And at the end of the year, they all sit down and tell you this is five after five years. This way we we'll move on. This way, and also they give you another five years. Mm. That rolling plan that these people they know where they go. They're they visionary. Exactly. You know, for me, the person I want to step into his shoe will know that yes, he has to sit up. It's a big shoe. <laughs> it's a big one. Ambrose, I must be honest with you, it's a very big one because but, 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 I, 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 have, I have watched, I have watched um, Wigwig um, closely and I, and I understand how visionary that young man, yes. that young man was. But he was not working alone. He has of course, to, he has of to course, behind. but he leads the team. <laughs> but he has yes, to yes. When another person stepped up to lead, mm. all that were running around him and giving the support they gave uh, Wigwig, for me, the access will move to the right. Right. Because Boom. I know when a, a bank like Access has solidify their major mm. even though they are not acquiring anything by now mm. again mm. let's solidify all our major and come let's slow down you see that that bank will overnight wow skyrocket mm. let's leave it at that let's come to the market tell us ambrose what played that at the exchange in the course of work last week give us your overview of what happened um, um especially last trading of the week um friday as we look forward to another trading activity starting from today you know well, no, on this program i like the way we always see things i told you the last week that we spread the market to us delayed but the, the negative uh, sentiment was in terms of uh, no sell volume and also no uh, sell sentiment was seen that will continue and i'm not surprised you know after uh, the, the cbn governor being the chairman of the the monetary policy you know committee you no know, when he spoke at the uh, you know uh, arise tv he gave a signal and also on wednesday for more he spoke we, we saw action of uh, a treasury be moving from you no know, 11.45 to 19. Mm. you know that was you no know, people never expected it above the NPR, which is a you know, monetary policy rate, which is a 18.75. You now see that one year tenor for treasury bill is a 19. It's above it. Automatically, you have sent a signal to investment that in the, in, the, in the coming MPC meeting, there will be rate hike. And one rate is like, which settle will for my let's say that is the equity market. But one thing that Nigeria investors are becoming sophisticated in terms of knowledge, they know that when you increase rate, there are some sectors or industry that will benefit from any activity. That's why policy matters a lot. Mm. Even though it's from, from the physical authority, come from the authority. When the policy comes, it is for you to digest. That is why after the news on 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 Thursday, so everybody will run out to sell. But on Thursday, you see, on the on the uh, secondary market, the yields drop from sustain, uh, from nineteen to sixteen. Mm. On Monday, on, on Friday, sorry, on Friday, we saw the buying interest in the capital market, market uh, in the stock market. Mm. We saw a rebound, you know, in some stocks, which the trend has continued this morning. As we speak now, we are seeing positive trend as right. markets are coming today, you know, extending what we saw yesterday. But what is that? When you see high cap stocks leading the index, well, you might say it's true that 
it's not reflecting on the general market because these are high caps that their price move index will go up. But we'll look at the sectors that are doing well and also the results that I've seen so far in terms of unrated account to give us an insight of what we should be doing as investors. Don't just follow the market. You are in the market to make money. Which company has the capacity to pay good dividend? Take to that and invest in that company. Not because market is going or going down. You know that if some company has different capacity, there's one who pays you know, then go in for those people that have different characteristics that will support you what you are because you're not in the market to watch market movement or not. You are there to make money. You are not there to watch your mm. other players. You know why you're in the market mm. and let that guide you. That's why you must have a, a plan to, to always trade your plan. It's as simple as that. Perfect. I like that. Now let's look at inflation. Inflation is likely to come out. The personal report for the month of January. We're expecting it to come up this week on Thursday precisely. What will this fundamental have on the market activity for this week? It's not only in Nigeria that we're expecting the data like inflation. It's across the globe. You can see that, mm. you know, in U.S., all eyes are on the, you know, the Fed. Uh, uh, no, not the Fed, on the uh, consumer price index tomorrow, mm. uh, tomorrow Tuesday. I always come in at either on, the, on, on Thursday. Thursday. You can see, they are all G3 investors to see if the inflation will go up again in mature market so that they will know where to to go but already we know where our inflation is going in mm. nigeria mm. that is going to go up and that's why those in fixed income market are reassessing the opportunity they are having there is it worth it because if inflation moves to 30 percent or 31 percent i'm i'm investing that i have 19 percent for a whole year i can make 30 percent in equity market in less than two to three months where we have so timing like i said one of the program is very is key in any work in any investing because don't just say you don't time market you time the market because mm. that's how we have time and season and that's why i have first quarter second quarter that's why i have a, a monetary policy that's why i have a no all this, it tells you when to be in the market for mm -hmm. me if we're expecting earnings to come this period and it come with a kind of a dividend reward you should know what to do for me investors should not just look at the uh, yields or at, at 16 or 19 or look at if i wait a whole year if i bring 50 million today they give me um 10 million or 5 million ahead of you no know, a whole year when, when the year the inflation is going at the end of the year because the dream or the vision or the forecast of the CBN that they want to achieve uh, you know, 21 percent uh, inflation in 2024, mm. I think that one is like, uh, for me, I don't know. How mirage, right? Yeah, <laughs> because you also, we are planning to increase wages. Yes. We are planning to increase wages. At the same time, while, you know, we are still we are fighting with FS. We are FS almost 1,500. If we are bringing this in Nigeria, we are already importing inflation to Nigeria economy. Mm. Also, if you increase wages, people, protest will come up. They also go to the same market, demand for those goods that are few, that are very scarce, that are limited. But it will go up. No, mm. I don't know the more. That's why if you are increasing your interest rate to attract foreign investors, where you have any insecurity in your environment, you are trying to discourage the you know the local business to run because if the cost of borrowing fund is high, how will I expand? Mm. But rather I start you know bringing Shinking. down my business automatically i'm going to create unemployment mm. and it's economy that you want to work you want to create uh, unemployment it's economy that you want to price stability for me i think they should rethink their model and also physical should also have a way of coming in to see how they balance all this good one now let's talk about what's playing out in the fixed and um, um, um commodities market as we turn to wrap up now the fixed and commodities market what would you have to say concerning that for me the oil price before now who that is the major market for commodity market i've seen that stock you know uh, that market you know record almost six percent for last week mm. but the good thing is that today because of fear of uh, this uh, ceasefire that the israel, uh, israel has not uh, accepted it's already sending a signal and at the same time you know don't forget that when oil price is up it's going to trigger to other things because that is a major source of people business especially in us in china this big economy they need oil and also if there's inflation that's why the mature economy central banks are still waiting that's why they left their rate on change for their first meeting looking forward to their second one in march to see what that's why all ICN and nigeria are still on what on what our our uh, mpc will be doing come at 26 27 on this but for me the commodity market as it was so inflated but for any investor they balance your portfolio at this time no, are you taking commodity? Are you taking fixed income? Are you taking a bond? Are you taking a treasury? Are you taking stock? Have a good, robust portfolio so that whenever the market moves anywhere, mm. you are balanced. I try to be to be what successful investor. All right.